Ever wonder why some of the most successful people in the world seem so quiet about their achievements? What if I told you that the secret to their success might just be their silence? Intriguing, isn't it? Let's explore this concept further. Consider the legendary investor Warren Buffett. Despite his massive success and influence, he remains notably reserved about his ventures. He doesn't constantly broadcast his every move, but instead values privacy and discretion. This is not due to shyness or lack of confidence, but rather a strategic approach to success. You see, constantly talking about what's going on in our lives can lead to a barrage of unnecessary pressure and expectations. It's like painting a target on your back. Each time we share our plans or ambitions, we open ourselves to scrutiny, judgment, and sometimes even sabotage. And let's not forget, talk is cheap. The more we talk about our plans, the less time we spend actually executing them. Ever heard the saying, actions speak louder than words? It's a cliche for a reason. It's the doers who change the world, not the talkers. Moreover, there's a certain power that comes with silence. It breeds focus fosters self-reflection, and cultivates resilience. It allows us to listen more, to understand better, and to think deeper. It gives us the space we need to grow without the constant noise of others' opinions and expectations. Silence, my friends, is not a sign of weakness or ignorance. Quite the contrary. It's a tool wielded by the wise and the successful. It's the shield that guards their focus, the sword that cuts through distractions, and the armor that protects their peace of mind. So the next time you're tempted to share your every thought, plan, or achievement, remember Warren Buffett. Remember the power of silence. Remember that your journey is yours alone to traverse, and that sometimes the most profound statements are those left unsaid. Now let's dive into why silence can be your greatest ally. In a world obsessed with sharing, why should we consider the opposite approach? This question may seem counterintuitive in our digitally connected age, where every moment, every thought, every meal is broadcasted to the world. But let's take a moment to delve a bit deeper. Consider social media, a platform that has become synonymous with sharing. It's a digital stage where we present ourselves, our achievements, our highs and lows. It's a continuous stream of information, a waterfall that never ceases, yet what impact does this relentless sharing have on us? It's like being in a never-ending race, where everyone is trying to outdo each other. This constant comparison can lead to stress, dissatisfaction, and a sense of inadequacy. We become so engrossed in portraying the best version of ourselves that we often lose sight of who we truly are. Take Marie Kondo, for instance. She's an influencer who has championed the concept of minimalism, urging people to declutter their lives to keep only the things that spark joy. Now imagine, what if we applied this same principle to the information we share about our lives? What if we were more selective, more mindful about what we put out there? This doesn't mean we stop sharing altogether. Rather, it's about choosing quality over quantity. It's about leaving some things unsaid, some moments unshared. It's about understanding that not everything needs to be public and that there's beauty in keeping certain aspects of our lives to ourselves. This is where the paradox lies. Even though we live in a world that encourages sharing, sometimes the most empowering thing we can do is to hold back, to keep some things to ourselves. It's about finding the balance between sharing and silence. Silence isn't about hiding. It's about finding peace and focus. Let's explore how. The beauty of silence lies in its ability to give us space, to allow us to reflect and focus. In the next scenes, we will delve deeper into the benefits of working in silence and how we can incorporate silence into our lives. So stay tuned and prepare to embark on this enlightening journey with us. What happens when we stop broadcasting our lives and start focusing on our work? Let's dive into the fascinating world of silent productivity. When we choose silence over noise, we are essentially choosing focus over distraction. We are creating a space, a sanctuary where our thoughts can run free, unencumbered by the constant chatter of the outside world. Imagine the mind as a lake. When it's still and undisturbed, you can see your reflection clearly. But when it's agitated, the surface ripples and distorts, and clarity is lost. 
That's what happens when we're constantly broadcasting our every move and thought. Our focus is scattered and our productivity is diluted. Now let's consider the benefits of working in silence. First and foremost is the improved focus. In silence, we can concentrate on one task at a time, giving it our full attention. This leads to better quality work. As the saying goes, where focus goes, energy flows. Next, there's less distraction. Silence lets us tune out the white noise of the world. No more getting caught up in the latest social media drama or spending precious time crafting the perfect status update. Instead, we can pour that energy into our work. Increased productivity is another major benefit. With improved focus and fewer distractions, we naturally get more done. We can accomplish in a few hours what might otherwise take a whole day. Silence also allows for deep work, a concept popularized by productivity expert Cal Newport. Deep work is the ability to focus without distraction on a cognitively demanding task. It's a state of flow where you can produce high-quality work in less time. Consider the example of successful entrepreneurs like Elon Musk. They often work quietly behind the scenes away from the public eye. They're not constantly tweeting or updating their status. Instead, they're focused on their mission, allowing their results to speak for themselves. Silence also fosters creativity. In the quiet, our minds can wander and explore, leading to new ideas and insights. Just think of the great inventors and thinkers of history, like Albert Einstein or Isaac Newton. They didn't come up with their groundbreaking ideas in the midst of noise and chaos. They had their eureka moments in solitude and silence. Lastly, working in silence can lead to greater satisfaction. When we're not constantly seeking external validation, we can find fulfillment in the work itself. We can take pride in our accomplishments knowing we achieved them through our own effort and determination. So, as we've seen, silence can be a powerful tool. It can improve focus, reduce distractions, increase productivity, foster creativity, and lead to greater satisfaction. But how can we incorporate it into our lives? Ready to embrace the power of silence? Here are some practical steps. Firstly, let's talk about setting boundaries on social media. In an era where oversharing is the norm, it's crucial to establish limits. Think of your digital space as your personal sanctuary. Just as you wouldn't invite the entire world into your home, you don't need to share every aspect of your life online. Adopt a less is more approach. Share less, observe more. This practice isn't about keeping secrets. It's about cultivating a sense of personal space and inner peace. Secondly, consider keeping your plans and goals private. Have you ever heard of the phrase, work in silence and let your success make the noise? There's wisdom in these words. When you broadcast your intentions, you open them up to scrutiny and potentially negativity. By keeping your goals to yourself, you maintain control and focus. Remember, the only validation you need is your own. Now let's shift our focus to actions rather than words. Actions are tangible. They can be seen, felt and experienced. Words, on the other hand, are simply sounds that fade into the ether. By focusing on actions, you're less likely to be distracted by chatter, both internally and externally. Incorporating silence into your life is not an overnight process. It requires consistent effort and practice. But the rewards are immeasurable, offering you a sense of peace and clarity that's hard to find in today's noisy world. To further illustrate this point, let's look at the teachings of mindfulness expert Thich Nhat Hanh. A renowned Zen master, Thich Nhat Hanh promotes silence and presence as a means to cultivate peace and productivity. He says, silence is essential. We need silence just as much as we need air, just as much as plants need light. If our minds are crowded with words and thoughts, there is no space for us. This profound insight encourages us to create space in our lives for silence. To do so, we must choose to step away from the noise, the constant chatter, the incessant influx of information. We must choose to create a sanctuary of silence within ourselves. This sanctuary is not a place of isolation, but a place of reflection, growth, and deep understanding. Silence is not about ignoring the world around us. It's about quieting the noise so we can hear what truly matters. 
It's about tuning out the distractions so we can tune into our own thoughts, feelings, and instincts. It's about creating a space where we can listen to the whispers of our own hearts. Incorporating silence into your life is a journey, not a destination. It's a practice, not a perfect. It's a commitment to yourself and to your own well-being. Remember, silence isn't about shutting out the world. It's about inviting in focus and peace. So take a moment, breathe in, breathe out. Listen to the silence. It has so much to say. Before we wrap up, consider this. Will you let the noise of the world distract you? Or will you choose to embrace the power of silence? Just as a single pebble can create ripples across a vast lake, your decision to cultivate silence can have a profound impact on your life. It can shape your thoughts, your actions, and your results. It's like learning a new language, the language of silence. And once you become fluent in it, you'll find that it speaks louder than words. In this journey of understanding, growth, and transformation, you're not alone. This channel is your companion, your guide, your resource. It's a beacon in the stormy sea of noise, offering you insights, inspiration, and the tools you need to navigate your journey. So, if you haven't done it yet, why not subscribe? Hit that notification button. Make this channel a part of your daily routine, your daily source of encouragement and motivation. Because every journey begins with a single step, and subscribing could be that step for you. But don't keep this resource to yourself. Each of us knows someone who could benefit from embracing the power of silence. Maybe they're struggling to find their focus, to make their mark, to find their voice. Share this video with them. Help them discover the transformative power of silence. As we conclude, remember that silence isn't just the absence of noise. It's a space for reflection, for growth, for intuition. It's a canvas for your thoughts, your dreams, your ambitions. In the words of Albert Einstein, the only valuable thing is intuition. Let's work silently, let our results speak, and let our intuition guide us. Share the silence, share the success. Embrace silence, let it shape your thoughts, your actions, your results. Let it be your guide, your mentor, your muse. And remember, when it comes to silence, the possibilities are endless. So what will you create with yours?